government has had to, uh, obviously has had to adjust its uh, budget outlays and NHI is part of the government department that receives uh, a subsidy for the implementation of NHI. So we have had to sit down and adjust the, the uh, services that are being provided in our NHI clinics. Um, at this point in time, given our our budgetary ceilings per month, we have had to address or do some slight cutbacks on pharmaceuticals, um, labs, and imaging services in the south side um, and in the rest of the country as well. Let me talk specifically about the Belize City south side because that's where primarily I think the effects are being felt. Um, because we initially used to cover all, almost all medications on uh, generally very, um, very good catalog of of medications. Um, so people could initially just go in, get a prescription, and they pay a ten percent copayment. Um, given the limitations we have, we have had to put a what we call a cap on the expenditure per clinic. So when People send referrals um, for pharmacy. Um, the, the, uh, some of the people will get their medication fee, but once you reach the ceiling on expenditure for the month, they're unable to provide it um, totally free of cost anymore. So while the medication is available, people will have to pay for that um, for that medication, or for the lab, or for um, X-ray imaging services. 